prosthetic arm and his only joys are smoking from his pipe. He's a very nice man. Do you want to show the awesome features of your snowman? Here's his hat. Show his hat. Nice hat. His scar. His buttons. And his dark, beady eyes. <laughs> Any other comments, things you need to talk about? Well, he's been scratching. He's about how he looks still. His, this arm is the real arm, and that's his prosthetic arm, because he lost his arm in the war. And, yeah. That's it. How did he lose his arm in the war? Um, you know, bombs. Yeah, <laughs> explosion. Um, but, yeah. Yeah. It just kind of disappeared. All right. So your last chance to make a plea to Mrs. Wong, who's going to judge these? Um, Please. <laughs> he just wants to live a happy life after the war. Yeah. He has kids, but he doesn't know how he feels about kids anymore. Yeah. Because he's the PTSD, you know? He just needs something good in his life. Make yeah. him the winner. Make yeah. him the winner. All right. I'm Abby. This is you can introduce yourself. I'm JR. I'm Lily. I'm Tiffany. And this is our snowman case. Um, the theme of it. Here, I'll come over to you. So this is our first piece in, the, in our um, showcase. And this is. Um, I'll tell you the whole story. So this is a girl named Megan, and she um, had a hard life, and she ended up as a stripper. So one day from daycare, this is her son over here. His name's Card. Remember, she's a stripper, so you know, un un unconventional names. So, this is Megan, and she had a really hard day at work. And on her way to the daycare, after she picked up her son, she was kind of indulging in some drinking. Okay, get close enough. She, she was indulging in some drinking, and um, she got in a car accident, and this is the result. We just wanted to capture kind of the loss. The loss that you would be feeling. Um, after you see your own mother perish. So she, so this is far and he's reaching out to his lonely dead mother. So, so the name of our piece is loss of a family member. And it's just, we wanted to capture that in our piece. Okay, so as a group, this is your last chance to make a plea to Mrs. Wong, who's gonna judge these. Why should your group win? Our idea is definitely original. decide to pick our Megan and baby. Farts. So, farts. farts yes. um, also, yeah. the, the, the snow isn't packing snow and we realized that. So we overcame that obstacle yes. by doing it on the ground because we knew it would work better. So we kind of worked with what we had. Yes. Figuratively and literally. All right, thanks. I, don't, I can't think of doing any more work than this. Uh, recording. Okay, come on in here. You're our third and final group. Yeah. So I need you to introduce yourselves. I'm Daphne. I'm Calista. <laughs> and can you talk about your creation? Okay, so our creation. Um, and, and get really close. Yeah, okay. it's essentially um, a snowman. Yeah. And its babies uh, don't like him anymore. And they were just like, yeah, I'm going to eat him. And yeah, so they just like climb on and chop it off. Very cool. this is the winner. Okay, so we believe that you are a very creative teacher and that you like when we have big ideas, big thoughts, really put our thoughts into our pieces. So this one, there's so much thought going into it, so much detail, time and effort, everything. so much. We planned this a day ahead. I bet everyone else just came up with it today. So, you know what I mean? Like, I think we deserve to win. Yeah. I have a story behind it. I found my hand. Yeah. Now they're colored. Uh, yeah. Not frostbite. Not frostbite. But, <laughs> yeah. Well, I 
we just put so much time, effort, and thought in trying to detail. Yeah, so we think we deserve to win. Yeah. Alright, thank you. No cool. problem. Okay.